Hello and welcome to episode 16 of my Kingdoms and Castles Let's Play. Now, last episode I think we ended off with the Vikings attacking or running away. I don't really remember. It's been quite a while since the last time I played this game. And I don't know if the Vikings are going to attack or run away. But last episode, we ended up having a horrible plague in Ironton. Wait, no, that was... I think that was the episode before last episode. I don't really remember. Anyway, the Vikings are, I think, attacking Ironton. No, oh, yep, last episode... No, the last episode was not the plague one, it's when we got attacked by some more Vikings. Now, I think these guys are going to attack Ironton, so I'm going to have to take control over Sir Rowley and some of his troops. I'll station the archers over there. And never mind. I'm going to move them from there to the side over here so they can open fire against the Vikings. Open fire! Open fire! Are, th are they out of range? Sure. They're not out of range of that ballista. Wow. That did a lot of damage. Are they running away or are they gonna... Is it still made of a ballista? Come on, a few more hits and, and it's gonna get destroyed. No, it's, it's just out of range of the ballista. No. Okay, good, they're firing at the shit then. Open fire! Don't let it escape! Open fire! Oh, yep, they landed, they landed, they landed. Back up a little bit, back up a little bit. Back up a little bit, then open fire! Open fire! Take him out! Retreat! Open fire! Retreat! Retreat! Open fire! They're stuck in the fields! Take him out! We got him! Okay, where are the other Vikings? There's still some Vikings in there. So there are still some Vikings coming around there. I think that part was a success. Now let's move these guys back over there. In case the Vikings try to land right there. Now over an island island. We've got a lot of stone and a lot of wood. I don't really know what the goal of today's episode will be, but I don't know. Yet. I think. Yeah, we've got a lot of charcoal and iron. I think I'll build. I'll, I'll build. I'll build some more blacksmiths. Why not? Okay. Now that that's done, where are the Vikings? They're running away. That's right. You better run. You better run, you cowards. And never come back. You won't get away with stealing our gold like you did last episode. Take him out. Is it still in range? Yeah, it's still in range. Then it'll be in range for this bullet tower pretty soon. It's being shot at by that archer tower. I don't I don't think it'll get away. Come on. Wait, no! There's a hole in the wall. They're gonna land right there. No! Come on. It's so low. Finish it! Finish it! Finish him! Yeah! We sunk their ship! One. Okay, so we defeated the Vikings, and there's a bunch of idle people here. So is this full? Yes, it is full. I think I will build. I think I need to build a few more. I'm like, I'm gonna build four more of those, and then build a lot more orchards. I'll build one there, one there, and then I'll just build some farms. Okay, that should be good. Um, I think I should probably build some defenses. Okay, I'll build an archer tower. 
Actually, I'll build a ballista right there. Yep, I'll build... I'll build up some more defenses right there. Okay. Then I'll also build... A manor to expand the population. Right there. Okay. Now let's go over here. And... Okay, good. We have some troops. And... I think I'll send some reinforcements over to... To Ironton in case we lose those troopers. So where is the transport ship? The transport ship is right there. I sent my troops over there. They can board the transport ship. Then I'll send the transport ship over to Ironton. Now when these blacksmiths are to be built... I think I'll chop down these trees and make this whole thing stone. Boom. I'm starting to upgrade the infrastructure. You know what? I think today's episode should really be about upgrading the infrastructure of Island Island. Because last episode we upgraded the infrastructure of Ironton to mostly be made of stone. So I think I should continue to do that. And then I should also do that in Iron in Island Island as well. Now my I I kinda have a plan for this area. And I think I'm gonna turn this whole area into like housing. Like the whole area is housing and farming. The place with the area with the most arable um or the most um fertile land will be farming and the rest of it will just be housing. This will be like completely industry. I think that would be a good idea. And then, you know, this area, this entire area will be farming. Same with this area. This area is housing. And this entire area is also just some more infrastructure, um, or some more industry. Like that. So, is there anywhere I could. You know what? I am gonna add I have some tools now so I can remove some rocks so I can get a second or a, a fourth quarry to get some more stone. We also have a lot of wood. Am I able to transport more wood here? Okay. Yep, that's that's good. What about what about in here? Yep, I want everything there so I can sell as much as I can. And then I said a couple of episodes ago I would make a market right there. And you know what? Today's question for this episode is what should I name this market? The market that is going to be built right next to this tavern. What should I build this market? Also, put the ship over there so I can put these troops on the ship. Then move them to Ironton. Got these two working. Yep. You know what? I want one of them making armaments, one of them making tools, and one of them making both. Okay, and I will make this area housing and this area farming. I think that's a good idea. Okay, get on the boat. Okay, good, now that they're on the boat, I will send them right there. Then I will build a bridge. Then I will build a bridge over. I will build. Okay, how expensive are bridges? Okay, stone bridges are pretty expensive. I'll just build it out of wood for now. Boom. Then I'll also build one, two, three, four. Okay, good. Then. I'll turn this into farming, then this into housing. Perfect. Might as well add another stockpile right here. I have a lot of stockpiles, don't know if I really need all these stockpiles. Charcoal maker. Cut down that tree, then I have a charcoal maker right there. Is there anywhere else I could build another forest over here? No, I think this is the maximum amount. Unless I can expand it like this. Would a bridge like that 
connect them back. Yes, it would. I will build a bridge to connect them like this. Okay, now that we've got a bunch of construction going on, go over to Ironton. Okay, I'll place these troops over here, and then I'll send this ship back over to Island Island. Okay, the taverns are too crowded. Try building more. Okay, well, is there any place in town that doesn't have a tower? Okay, I think I kind of want to come up with a plan. Okay, I think I want to make this area industry, then I could make this some more farming. Then I could just make this, like, all housing. Yeah, sure, I'll make that housing. I'll build a tavern right beside... right beside the... right beside the cemetery. You can mourn your grandmother who passed away then then go have a drink at the tavern which is right beside a manor and obviously I need a well because you know they kind of need water to live like I, I need some more stones to build a well and I got that right now I'll build it right I'll build it right there okay and a merchant has arrived okay where is the merchant Oh, it's right here. Okay. Okay, we don't really need to buy anything here, in particular. Oh, we could sell some stuff. We could sell all the... Actually, we'll wait for the cargo ship to leave, so that we don't sell anything that we're transporting. Okay. I'll just sell that. Then, you know what? I'm gonna be nice. I'm gonna buy them some pork. Yeah. Boom. I'll buy, some... I'll buy him some pork. Okay. So, okay, this is good. We have a bunch of extra space. Now, can I build a, a forester? Another forester over here? I could build it right there. Then I could build a second one right there. Then build some more stuff over here, like a... I could build a mason. I don't think it would be smart to have a mason right there, because masons, if you didn't know... They take stone, like, you know, the quarries, and then they repair damaged uh, buildings. So I think it would be smartest to have it right there. Um, beside the stone. So that it's uh, most of the more efficient. Speaking of stone, I think it's time to up continue to upgrade the infrastructure. This is a pretty high traffic road, so I'll upgrade that one. And again, um, what should I name this market? What should I name it? That is the question. I don't really know what I'm going to make the thumbnail. I might make it, like, a zoomed in. Oh, I need to repair this. Looks like from the Great Island Island Fire a couple episodes ago, I never really fixed that. I could, like, make this the thumbnail. Because of the stone road. Because this episode is all about upgrading the infrastructure. Or, or I could make it. Or I could show this stone road. Wow, this is a pretty busy road. I guess it is where a bunch of people live. So. That is, pro that is pretty important. And, okay. Ironton. Ironton. It's year 106. Ironton. 17 people. 12 people. Okay. 12 people visited Iron Tin, or 17 visited Iron Tin, and 12 found a home to stay. Okay, I have some more stone. I'll keep upgrading roads. Which is the most used road? This is a pretty used road. I'll upgrade that. Okay, good. Then I will... Uh, I don't- I don't know. What- what buildings should I put in here? Should I just put a bunch of stockpiles? Should I put some charcoal makers? Cause that's really all I can do. Charcoal makers and stockpiles. I don't really need any more stockpiles, but we also have a lot of charcoal, so... I don't know. There's just not a lot of stone in this kingdom. But I could- I could colonize, um, this island, which I think should be called Stoneland because there's stone there. Stone there, and stone there. 
There's a lot of stone. Actually, Iron Tin also has a lot of stone. I should probably, um, use some of the stone to my, uh, advantage. Probably helpful to have a bunch of stone. This is... That's really annoying. Okay, also the town hall. Is that... Yep. Our churches and libraries are too crowded. Well, we don't have any churches. Oh, I just got th thought of a really good idea. Okay, so, we built the church. We don't have enough stone to build the church, but when we do have enough stone to build the church, we'll build the church right there, right beside the cemetery and the tavern and some random house. Okay, we've got a dragon attack and a viking attack in the next two years. I think, though, I'll have to deal with that in the next episode, because I don't really want to make this video a super long one. Okay, people are happy in Island Island. That's good people have jobs. We're just kind of running out of space to live, honestly. And space to develop. Our libraries and churches are too crowded. Okay. Come on, we, we're almost... We need some more wood, is, is what we need. Okay, so I'll make... I'll make another floor. I'll make another forester right there. Yeah, we just need some more wood and stone. Honestly, just to build my... To build the church. We've got a bunch of wood that we don't really need. You know what we could do? What we could do to um, maximize our efficiency when it comes to when it comes to um, the amount of wood we have, because we have a lot of wood. I think a way to maximize the efficiency would be if we built a dock. Like if we built a dock right here, we could call this like resource dock, and then. We could only store resources here, and if we have an excess of resources, we could always just sell it and make some more gold. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Also, on this island, I kind of want to make, like, a vault. A vault to store all the gold. Like, you know, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, like, this much space as a giant vault to store all the kingdom's gold. I think that would be a pretty good idea. And... I but I will have to do that next episode along with defend my kingdom against a dragon attack and a viking attack. If you've watched this video so far, um, what should I name this market? Also, if you like the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And um, thank you for watching, and goodbye.